the more you bend your left arm, the worse your toss is going to be. That's what it boils down to. You've got the serve, and you've got the how you start up. That is how you set up on the baseline. My side. I want you to take a look at my fingers. Put it all together. Only release the ball as you're going forward. So, you want the left arm to be relatively straight. Well, basically, it's just a philosophy that if you learn how to play uh, using one of the correct methods, chances are you'll get better, you'll enjoy the game, but I think more importantly, you, you may wind up playing the game with fewer injuries. Mm -hmm. That is, I think a lot of the injuries today, tennis elbow, bad backs, uh, bad knees, uh, are due to people learning the game incorrectly, using the, the wrong grip and so forth, not uh, being sufficiently warmed up when they play. I enjoy seeing people improve on the spot. That is, if I tell somebody something that they've been doing incorrectly for 15 years, and all of a sudden I show them the right way, and they, they're so happy that you know, they fall all over themselves. That's very satis satisfying to me. Your right leg on over. Let it drag on over. Good. To use an analogy like teaching tennis, if you can show them a better way, another way of doing it, so that they themselves will then turn around and say, hey, maybe this way is better, then, may, then you've done something, I guess. That's, is that easy, that one? That'll be $25. <laughs> that? Bring your right leg over. Come on. Come on. Almost. Oh, sorry.